Yo, what is good people? It's Ocean here. Welcome to the video. Welcome to the channel. So Mixed and Key just sent me a bunch of their plugins. Captain Beat, Captain Melody and Captain Chords. So I'm going to be testing them out today. I've seen their ad pop up so many times on my YouTube. It's been a plugin that I really wanted to try out for a while now. So I'm going to be making a beat using those plugins. Before we get into the video though, Text me, I have a number, this is it right here on the screen. I did see in the comments of the last video, some people were a bit wary, a bit scared. They're thinking it was a scam or some conspiracy or Illuminati, I've joined some company. No, I think this is just the best way for me to communicate with you through text. So if you wanna do that, hit me up right here. The first text message that I'm gonna send you, it is an automated one, just because as you can imagine, a lot of people are texting in and I need to know who you are, I wanna know who you are. The first text will ask you to enter your info, like your name and where you are. And then from there, you can talk to me, you can send me a question and I'll try to respond as soon as I can. Oh yeah, it is a US number, so if you're outside the US, let's say you're texting from the UK or Sweden, if you don't have international text, then it might not work for you. But if you do, you're good to go. It was charge you the international rate of, I don't know, whatever company you use as your phone line. So yeah, go ahead, text me. I'm gonna check out these plugins right now. It's about to be a vibe as always. Sit back, enjoy, let's get into the video. Ocean gang go drown. Stay hydrated. Word to Patrick CCTV. I want to make a melody first, so I'm going to pull up Captain Chords. Basically, the plugin generates a chord progression for you. It has like all these different progressions there. You can choose your key. Let's, I don't know, I'll just stick with A minor. That sounds cool. Let's pull this BPM up to like, I don't know, one, 145 will do. So we've got chords here. We can choose one of these progressions. There's so many. They even got a ton of different instruments in here. Guitars, keys, leads, there's so many. What I'm gonna do though, instead of using their sounds, I wanna use Electra X. The way that we can use Electra X plus Captain Chords is in the MIDI effects right here. You can just select mixed in key, Captain Chords. And now we've got our pad from Electra X. Let's find a chord progression. That sounds weird. Kind of like that. You know what? I'm just going to keep it simple. I like the chords like that. Sounds weird. Sounds a bit dreamy. I'm just going to take that MIDI file, drag it into the timeline. As simple as that really. I made that chord progression in like two seconds. I think this will sound nice. Reverse, I'm just gonna bounce that in place and turn it into an audio file. And then let's chop like where I did the chords. I'm just pressing Command and T. And then I'm holding down Shift and selecting the chords that I'm gonna reverse. Go to region and then reverse that. And then I'm gonna take everything, fade it in and out a bit. So it has like a weird chop. So I'm gonna take those chords that we made before, put them in this piano right here. Sounds so weird, so strange. Just gonna take up the attack a bit. Let's throw some half speed on this. I got a pad open from Omnisphere, so I'm just gonna drag down that MIDI. Let's get rid of all these bass notes. Just 
deleting those chords and then repeating these ones over. Oh, that sounds cool. Let's delete that, control everything, and then repeat that. This is sounding crazy, it's sounding weird, but I like it. Let's add a melody, like a counter melody to Garden So I'm gonna open up Captain Melody now. So I'm gonna duplicate the piano that I was using because I wanna use the piano sound. And then I'm just gonna go to audio effects and pull up Captain Melody. So we can connect it to the melody that we had before. So the first thing I'm gonna do is hit Magic Record. So I can actually like play in an idea that I have already and then we can fiddle around with it after. So I'm just gonna hit that button right there. Bam, bam, bam. Let's clear that. And then we can go into the idea part. Let's press plus. We can change up the rhythm if we wanted to. There's literally infinite possibilities with this. This is like a little cheat code right here. I can crank out so much melodies doing this. Oh, I like that. I think I might just leave my melody like that. I'm gonna drag in that MIDI file now. And then all I wanna do is move this up an octave. So this would be like faint in the background. Last thing I wanna to add to this melody is some vocal chops. Cause I'm gonna turn this into a dual beat and I feel like some vocal chops would be like the icing on the cake right here. So I'm gonna open up Arcade and try and find something. That sounds nice. Let's quantize that and throw in some reverb. I think that sounds good for the melodies. As always, I want to bounce this out, maybe throw in some effects on it. So I'm going to arrange it out, bounce it as an audio file, drag that back in. The usual. If you see my channel, you know what I'm about to do. Finish making a melody, gonna leave it like that. I wanna add in some drums now and I'm gonna be using Captain Beat to do everything. All right, so I've got Captain Beat open now and this is basically a really, really powerful drum sequencer. So you can add in your own drums if you wanted to. It comes with some stock ones here, but also you can change the drum kit here. They've got so many different drum kits. I haven't even been through all of these yet. Let's try a random one. Can even change up the pattern here. Let's look for like, let's try a hip hop one. Oh, they got an LJ the Giant one. Let's check this out. So if you didn't want to make your own pattern, you can literally just go in here, choose a pattern from any of these packs, and then choose your drum kit if you don't have any drums as well. And you're good to go. I'm gonna go for a drill beat, so I'm gonna use a drill drum kit. To use your own sounds, you can literally just take the WAV file, drag your samples in there. So I dragged the snare into this line, and then I can just customize it. I can move it into different places.
gonna control these and then I'm holding option and dragging that over this side. And then let's add in some rolls now. I like that. Let's change up the velocities a bit of those new hats. Let's turn that down a little bit so it doesn't clash too much. Nice and easy, just as simple as that. Now I want to put this on the timeline, so I'm going to go to export. I could choose to do it as an audio file or a MIDI, a master MIDI file, so I'm just going to choose that one. Let's drag that in. Move that to the side. And I just want the drums to be a bit louder, so to make this smack, let's add in a touch of overdrive. And then just a bit of reverb as well. As you can see, that was super easy to do. The only thing I want to add on top of this now is some 808s. Let's control that, quantize that. Let's rearrange this into a full beat and I guess I'm going to repeat these as well so I can divide up the melodies. In the beginning, I just want to keep it simple, something like that. Then we'll go into the drop, I'll get rid of the 808s for now, alright so let's delete that snare, that clunky metal hit, get rid of the kicks, get rid of so we have the hi-hats and the snare. After that we can go into the, the the main part, the chorus. After that we'll just go just keeping it nice and simple not much to it and then after that we can bring back in this melody okay, we, we can repeat that melody over Go into the nice chill part, compress command R to repeat that section, and that is it for the beat. That's the beat finished right there. 
One, two, three, bang, boom. That's it, just cooked up a drill beat from scratch using the Mixed In Keys plugins. Captain Chords, Captain Beat, and Captain Melody. They make life a lot easier, especially let's say you had beat block and you just don't have an idea of where you wanna take a beat or where you wanna take a melody. You can just pull that up, generates a chord progression and bam, you're good to go. And Captain Beat, you don't have any drum sounds. It's got like a bunch right there for you. You can literally just click in a pattern, select a drum kit and you've got a beat right there. If you wanna check out these plugins, I've got a link in the description where it'll take you to the website. But yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please, please, please hit that like button because it really, really helps the video out. That's it for this one. I appreciate every single one of you and I'll see you in the future.